I think we'll start again, everybody. <laughs> Sorry about that. We're now recorded. Welcome to Facebook land and welcome to those of you that are live. My name is Robin Blank Mascari. We get together here every Tuesday night and we have a rotation of very special doctors with us and we do an introduction to LifeWave a very 16-year-old uh, company. It just turned 16, just had its 16th birthday. And we'll talk a little bit about its founder, inventor. And then I have a special guest this evening that will introduce the technology to you and talk about that a little bit and talk about the star of the show. We have many products, but we're going to focus on one of them called X39. And then it's your turn. And you can ask questions and share testimonials. We love, love, love your stories because it's the stories that have lots of us think about other people that may benefit from what we have. So let me jump in and talk a little bit about this very special company that just turned 16 this month. And what's really exciting is from 2018 to 2019, for a 16 year old company, it tripled in sales. Last month, we had a record-breaking month of 18 million, and we crossed over the 100 million mark. So we're on our way to a billion, which is very exciting. And uh, things are growing very, very fast. The company started back in 2004. David Schmidt is our founder and CEO, and he had created a product for the, um, on a military contract for the Navy SEALs. This product was a survival product to help them stay awake in their mini subs without taking any um, chemicals or uh, caffeine to stay awake. Because a lot of people don't realize that Navy SEALs many times have to stay awake for days on end and they need to be absolutely sharp and alert. And the very first product called the Energy Enhancer was born in a form of light therapy that we're going to talk about in a little while. Well, 9-11 um, happened, the government had different priorities, and David was looking for how to share this brilliant technology with the world. And he chose, it's a science-based company. David is a researcher, uh, and he was introduced to the concept of network marketing because it's, uh, the product needs a voice. It needs our stories because sitting on the shelf, no one would know what it is. And so in 2004, he founded the company with one product called the Energy Enhancer. That one product does wonderful things and it got discovered by the sports community. Well, the sports community went crazy and one day David Schmidt got a call from the Olympic swim coach Richard Quick and he said that six of his eight swimmers did their personal best with the product. And David was kind of shocked. Well, that was the beginning of dramatic change with LifeWave because the word got out is in the sport, as many people know, there's nothing more finely measured than sport performance. And other uh, athletes were noticing the swimmers and uh, they thought they might have been doping. Well, with our products, nothing is going in the body. After many tests, tons of media, the company kind of went whoosh and took off. And our genius inventor, David Schmidt, is very busy in his lab creating more products. And, and so phase one of the company was what we call the symptom patch phase. And what I mean by that is uh, the patches actually address certain symptoms. So the energy patch address energy, and then this, the ice wave patch came next, and that actually reduced pain. And then there was a patch for sleep called Silent Night. So that was phase one. Phase two is what uh, turned into the anti-aging phase. And we have a series of patches called YH, glutathione, EN, and carnosine. And then David, for many, many years, has been fascinated with how to maximize human potential physically. And so he got into regenerative science and has been studying regenerative science. And a copper peptide was discovered by a researcher by the name of Dr. Lauren Picard. That peptide is known in scientific circles as the holy grail of health, healing, and regeneration. And David figured out how to crack the code to activate it. And the birth of X39 happened in 2018. Uh, it got introduced to the world in January of 2019. So that's why things 
just grew so fast because the results were amazing. A little bit about David Schmidt. Like I mentioned, he's a scientist. He's an inventor. He also has tremendous business acumen and he is our CEO. The company is in um, over 70 countries around the world with, I believe, 14 different distribution centers. And we are seamlessly operating, um, sharing, I think it was 30 million patches last year. I, I'm gonna have to get the details on that one. I shouldn't have said anything, but I'm not exactly certain, but millions and millions of patches out there. The technology actually, oops, it's not there. <laughs> I can't even show it to you, but we will show you what a patch looks like. and. David is an inventor. He has over a hundred patents and patent pendings to his name, and he loves research. You know, Gregory, my husband likes to say, you know, where other company owners want the bigger car, the bigger boat, the bigger house. David Schmidt, he wants to spend more money on research, and he commits millions of dollars to continue to validate the efficacy of the products that he creates in the lab. So we are thrilled to have over 80 clinical studies for our products. So what I'd like to do right now is introduce our special guest of the evening, one of um, my favorite doctors, who's made a huge difference in my life. Uh, she is a naturopath, she is an author, she's written two books, one on erasing autism, another on uh, being a naturopath. Uh, if naturopaths were quacks, I must be a duck. I think that's it. I hope that's right, Dr. Shauna. Uh, she recently moved her practice from Durango, Colorado to Boise, Idaho called Assertive Wellness and has clients coming from literally every state in the country and many countries around the world because she is a brilliant diagnostician and she was incredibly supportive beyond words when um, Gregory and I were going through a very difficult health challenge uh, in earlier this year. And I was, she was a godsend to us and a very dear friend, a very wise woman who's able to take very complex topics and make them make sense for the average mind. So I wanna welcome on Dr. Shauna Young. Please join us. There she is. <laughs> I'm sorry, I was trying to get my wild beast over here down. He heard, he, she heard your voice and she wanted to come up. And, and, Hello, Coyote. <laughs> she, is, she, is wearing, she is wearing her X39. So we can. Yes, and that's really valuable for people to know that <laughs> the patches work on all kinds of animals, like just about every kind. And we might talk about that a little bit tonight. So, Dr. Shauna, welcome, first Hello. of all. So, Rob, are you saying I'm a simple mind? <laughs> <laughs> no, we're the simple minds. You're able to bring something complex oh. to simple minds. No, no, that, you're the last thing from a simple mind, my dear. You know that. <laughs> I know. I just had to take the pun. For it. Yeah. Yes. No, it's wonderful. It's wonderful. So let's get started a little bit um, briefly. What, as, as a doctor, you're a naturopath, what excited you about incorporating the LifeWave patches into your practice? Well, one of the things that um, people always need to keep in mind when you're na with naturopaths is that we take the whole thing of do no harm very, very seriously. And that's one of the most important things to me. And anytime you give anybody anything that goes into their body, any kind of substance, you're taking a risk that, that something could happen because people can be allergic to something as simple as gel cap, you know, the, not even the product that's in it, but the gel cap that's around it. Um, you know, they could have a reaction. I mean, a, a, a very good example of that is peanuts. I mean, a peanut seems pretty benign, but some people, if they even get in the same room with a the peanut, they wind up in the hospital or worse. So, you know, whenever you're giving anybody any kind of a substance or anything that's going to physically go into their body in any way, you, tend, you run the risk of having something happen or having an adverse effect or an allergic effect or something like that. So the idea that these patches are only manipulating the light in your body 
and they're only working with the, um, the frequency that runs your body was very attractive to me because there's no possible way that you could cause any harm. Your body is not going to harm itself. So it, it'll do what it needs to for itself, which uh, uh, every once in a while means exacerbating a condition briefly or something. But that's just what it needs. Your body will give itself what it needs to heal. But it was a really wonderful thought to me that I could give them something. Also, too, as you mentioned, I have people come from all over the country and, and, and further um, so I can figure out what's going on with them. And very often these people have been the subject of a lot of medical intervention already. And they're taking multiple uh, prescription medications or, you know, things like that. And it, the X39 runs no, uh, no risk of contraindicating or anything with any of their medications. So it was a very safe way for me to be able to work with people. But really the main thing is that when for us to work, I need a foundation. It's, I always say, you guys probably heard this, but I always say, you know, you don't, if you want to build a house, you don't just throw it on some ground, you know, you don't just find some dirt and throw it up. You know, it's got to have a foundation and they have to dig down, they put cement down, they lay the groundwork and, and they give, you know, the house something to stand on. And what stem cells do in your body is they give your body is something to stand on. It gives your, you know, your immune system in your body and, and your body functions something to work from. And frequency medicine is such an, an interesting science anyway, because a lot of people, they talk about it, you know, like, oh, it's, my patients often joke with me and say, well, what witchcraft have you got for me today? And, you know, that kind of stuff. Just, I mean, they're kidding because they like me, but it's just, <laughs> otherwise I don't think they'd be here. But, um, you know, I do always have something new and I am always looking for the things that work. And what frequency medicine, the easiest way to understand it, because this isn't new age or, or new anything at all. If it wasn't for frequency, we would just be atoms flying around. Our, the only thing that keeps our bodies corporeal, that keeps us in a bag, so, you know, so to speak, that we are, is, is frequency and the frequency that holds your cells together and holds your body together. So what the LifeWay patches are doing in, uh, for our purposes tonight, most, most particularly the X39, but really all of them, is they're working with that frequency that is holding you into being a person. So it's not new, it's not new science, it's, or it's not even new age, it's just science. I love it. Yeah. So, so they're safe, they work, they do no harm, and that's really fabulous for people to know. We call them non-transdermal because nothing other than a frequency of light is going in the body. So I think we better explain the technology a little bit. It's called photobiomodulation. Right. So would you briefly share what that means with people? That's a really big word. That's a really easy one, again, to... Um to explain, you know, just as I just was talking about the frequency is what holds your body together. Photobiomodulation is just as simple, even though it, it is kind of a mouthful. Um, uh, the easiest way to understand that one is just the sun. You know, when the sun hits your skin at a particular frequency, then you create vitamin D. There's no vitamin D in your skin, there's no vitamin D in the sun, but when the two light sources connect, at a particular frequency, then you create vitamin D. If the two exact same light sources of the sun and your skin come into contact at a different frequency, then it creates melanin, which is what gives you a suntan. So, you know, there's all these different chemical reactions that can happen from any given light source and another one. And you have to think of your body is a light source. And that's what we're working with is the light that is within you as the main light source. So with the LifeWay patches, when you put the X39 on, I, I think of it as my own wearing, wearing my own little sun, you know, sometimes. I like and, that. And it's, and it's amazing too, of how the, the different things that it does. Um, you know, some of the patches are very specific in terms they're you know, they're for pain, they're for energy, they're for glutathione, they're for these things. The X39 is, is a much more, um, uh, sort of sexy product, you know, a romantic where, where it does all of these things all at once and it does it all without you having to work on it or think about it. Um, you know, with, with some of the patches, like, like the pain patches, the ice you know, you have to target them and move them around. And the X39 just does what it does. You put it on and away it goes. And well, I, I think you better tell people what it is. <laughs> well, 
the, that's what we're talking about with the photobiomodulation. No, but what X39 well, is, because you keep sorry. talking about it. I want to know what it does. Well, the, the, the sun that the X39 is turns on the GHKCU, the, the copper peptide that Robin's addressing that they call the holy grail. Um, of healing and regeneration. Um, it, the beauty industry was originally who got hold of it because the copper peptide has such incredible healing and regenerative effects on your skin. Um, everything from physically healing it or improving the elasticity all the way just to making you look better. So there's, you know, it was not unusual. Uh, when I first went to look at Picard's work and it was a like a beauty book or something, I was a little confused. I thought, okay, is this the right one? But it is because there are so many uh, uses of, of the GHKCU copper. Thank you. <laughs> see, you can see what I mean. It doesn't exactly look like, like a scientific novel. So, <laughs> or at least the ones I'm used to looking at. So, um, but, the, but what they were finding, that was just the, the original thing that they looked at. Now, when you, if you do a, a, an internet search, if you go and you put in GHK-CU, then you'll find all of these uh, scientific studies coming from NCBI and, you know, PubMed and all these various different places. And all of these studies say um, that the key to healing and the key to gene expression, the key to regenerative medicine is this GHK-CU, the copper peptide. But at the end of the, of the long thing, it always says, but we don't know how to get it get in your body. You know, it's like, we want it there, it'd be great, it's perfect, but, but, any, but we don't know how. So anyway, you know, let's move on. So uh, David just didn't move on. He was, David Schmidt was able to figure out what the light source was and how to program. When you look at one of the patches, there's the little fabric thing in the middle and the little, you know, uh, sticky part around it. And I always think of those little fabric parts as, mi as microchips because people understand microchips that you can program a microchip and the information goes into it and then it, it creates protocols within your computer. And if you think about it, this, these have been programmed to turn on that particular peptide within your body. So when you put it on, it's like plugging a microchip into your computer. Fascinating, fascinating. So you put this little thing that looks about a quarter size, mm -hmm. that looks like a Band-Aid on your body, mm -hmm. and it's the body heat that actually activates those little crystals in there, right? And they create right. a frequency. And yeah, that kind of watch them a little bit because they will activate when they're not touching you. Ah, that's really good to know. So yeah. um, they don't even need to touch your body. They can actually even be on your clothes or in a hat. I have my I have my smart hat right here. Oh, you yeah, have your smart hat, okay. <laughs> and it's loaded with batches. <laughs> yeah. Well, Coyote got it over, you know, her fur. You I, know. I keep it I, I keep it at my desk because it helps with calm and focus. Okay. It does many other things. So back to the patch, you put it on your body. Nothing goes in your body other than a frequency of light that causes a biochemical change. Correct. Mm -hmm. So we know that. It activates stem cells mm -hmm. and it does many other things. So you want to share a few of the other things that the copper peptide does other than, you know, and, and also one other question I'm going to add with that is why are stem cells so important? Well, stem cells, again, are building the foundation of your body being able to take care of itself and heal itself. Um, a stem cell is just an amorphous, you know, when stem cells are created, they have not yet decided what they want to do when they grow up. And so what happens is as soon as the stem cells is created, it's the GHK copper peptide that, that causes the stem cell to be created. But once it is created, then it decides what it needs to do. Um, it runs around your body and it looks for stuff to do. You know, like, oh, what, you know, what's down? What isn't working? What needs help? Where is their inflammation? Where, you know, and it says, oh, something's going on in the brain. So let me become a brain cell. And it goes off and does that. Oh, I want to be a blood, you know. And so it's wherever your body needs the help. And this is when I talk about the product being so interesting and, and, and multifaceted like that, is that you don't have to pick what you want it to do. All you have to do is put it on and your stem cells will pick what needs to happen. And that might be something like, you know, working with inflammation or working with various things like that in your body, but, um, or, or rebuilding something that needs help. But 
one of the most fascinating things to me about this uh, copper peptide in these is that it's the only thing that will up regulate and down regulate at the same time. Usually when you're working with something, it either up regulates or down regulates. Like it either, when you, like in traditional therapies, they go after like they target like killing something but they can't target killing it and fixing it at the same time. It's only the, the GHK copper peptides and the stem cells that can do that, that can actually work on getting rid of something and fixing it at the exact same time with no tug of war going on in your body. And another thing that it does too is there's nothing else that can fix your gene expression. And the gene expression is extremely important. If you see just, again, I try to simplify, if you see a child who is ill, that means that their gene expression is not working. Because in a young person or a young animal or whatever, everything should be working great. And in a person that is taking uh, care of themselves, that is you know, trying to do all the right things for themselves, everything should work. And so if something's not working, that means that the gene expression is off. So with the GHK copper peptides, that's really the only thing that can change the way that that's the way that your genes are expressing themselves. Um, I could go into DNA and RNA, but I'd rather not. So, um, yeah. but yeah, that's, that's, that's overhead. So, <laughs> so um, they activate stem cells and stem cells help repair our body and they, they have a wisdom. They know where to go. We don't need to tell them anything. Um, I, I wanted my knee to get better. And it, and it was a week of wearing a patch up here. And a week later, my knee pain was gone. But then all these other things started happening. Like exactly. my skin improved and uh, my eyesight improved and uh, my reaction time improved and my crooked finger straightened out. And, you know, just it's been really, really amazing. And as we get older, we have less of them, which is why we age. So the older we get, the less stem cells we have. The faster we age, the slower we heal. So it's really wonderful that by altering gene expression and more stem cells, we are turning back the clock, aren't we? Yes, and you made a good point. You said that you were wearing a patch on the back of your neck and your knee stopped hurting. And people need to understand that about the X39 as well. The, the gene activation, it, I mean, the uh, stem cell activation, the copper peptide activation is the only thing that the X39 has to do. You don't have to put it somewhere. People are like, well, can I put it on somewhere that it hurts? Well, yeah, but you can also put it on your t-shirt. I mean, it's, it's going to do the same thing. It's going to activate um, those particular, the, it, it's programmed to activate the GHK uh, CU peptide. And so wherever you put it, it's going to activate. So you don't have to have it stuck on something. But, but the, you know, on, on a, a spot that hurts or, you know, something like that. But um, stem cells are the key to uh, growing older, losing our stem cells when we're, when we're little kids, when we're babies, we have literally billion stem cells and they get less and less as time goes on. And by the time you get to be, you know, a little bit on in years, you're losing them. And by the time you've gotten to about 60 years old, you're not, you have like 70% less stem cells you used to have. So creating more stem cells is literally the only way of turning back the clock. This is not, um, you know, like anti-aging. Anti-aging is slowing down the clock. Stem cells are turning it backwards. This is, this is breakthrough. This is historic. The billion dollar companies have been trying to figure out how to activate this peptide yep. that literally turns back the clock and our genius scientist is becoming known all over the world in the scientific community for cracking the code that these billion dollar companies have not been able to crack and making it affordable. It's safe, it's affordable, it's natural, and most importantly, it works. So how about if we listen to some people that have some stories to share about how it works. And um, I think, let me find you, John. I think John wants to share a story. So John, I'm going to allow you to talk and you are on. Okay, hey I, think, I think you're muted, John. See if you can unmute. There Got you it. go. Can you hear, can now, you hear me? Now we can. Great. All right. And by the way, just yeah, I know you can't see me, but I have my hat in my hand with all my patches in it, too. <laughs> so I, I do wear that every day. But 
So when I started wearing the patches, we we lost you, John. He must have as good an internet as I have. Can you oh. hear me now? Now we can. Yep. That's weird. I don't know what happened. I don't know. Um, You're back. Okay, perfect. Uh, so when I started wearing them, I had no health issues. I'm 68. I, I don't, I take care of myself. I eat more of a ketogenic diet. Recently I switched to carnivore. And uh, so I take supplements. I've always been kind of health conscious and alternative. So, you know, a lot of people call me somewhat of a rebel. <laughs> I own that. So, but one thing that I really noticed right away is that I was sleeping better, sleeping deeper. And I noticed that within the first week. Yeah. And, uh, and then I, before COVID, I was going to the gym. When I would go to the gym, I found that I could work out more intently. So it really enhanced my sports performance, if you will. I still run. Um, and, but the big thing was, is the recovery the next day was like I didn't even go to the gym. Wow. So I was really blown away with that. And lastly, I have, from my mother, I had aging spots on my hand that were pretty pronounced. They're basically 70% faded. And so those things for me have been wonderful. And just this weekend, I handled a 4,000 PSI pressure washer for nine and a half hours. Oh my. I should have, I should have been like crawling for three days. No. By, I mean, I felt it on Sunday, but Mon yesterday, it, I felt great. Today, I feel amazing. Mm -hmm. And so those things just really set well with me. <laughs> I can see why. And what John said and what I said when he was sharing was, wow, we notice a lot. We say wow a lot. Yeah. <laughs> I have a little wow counter that Dr. Shauna gave me. <laughs> That's awesome. That's awesome. Yeah, you do. And, and honestly, there are times when I have to sit down and just be grateful and thankful because there's so many things that we can't even say that this does mm -hmm. just because we have to keep the long fingers of the FDA away. Mm -hmm. it's just amazing what this product does. Mm. I, I'm just, some days I'm in tears. Yeah. So I, I, thank you for letting me share. No, thank you so much. And if anyone else wants to share a story or ask a question, put it in the uh, chat box. Dr. Sean and I can keep going on forever because we love sharing about this. And uh, I'll, I'll actually share a quick story while we're waiting here for someone. And I think I shared it last week, but I'm going to share it again because it's so fun. Uh, Anheuser is one of our members. And oh, wait, here's, um, let's see, someone. Uh, um, okay, let me just ask the question from uh, Sunshower Rose. She goes, I'm two weeks into um, an infection. Uh, I'm allergic to antibiotics. My homeopathic has me on a specific remedy and it's spreading. I'm losing sleep because I'm itchy all over. Should I put more than one X39 on my body? Nope, the X39 does what it does. And you, you know, putting more on sometimes kind of helps your head, I think, you know, I mean, in terms of people thinking that they're doing as much as they can, but it's, it's really not a good idea. If you're itching, I would add, I would start adding other patches, like the glutathione patch would be my first thought. And you can put more than one of those on because those are a little bit, those work in a different fashion than the X39. But the Eon is a, a wonderful anti-inflammatory. Um, the glutathione will uh, increase people's glutathione. Uh, uh, your body's natural master antioxidant up to 300% within a 24 to 48 hour period. So anytime you're talking about something like, like that, that's the direction I would go, definitely. But as far as the X39, you just need one. Fabulous. I'm gonna ask that, because that comes Fabulous. up. Yeah. Okay, and we've got, oh, well, a whole bunch of things just came in here. Um, Jenny wants to know, can you please explain retracing or remapping? Oh, sure. Um, your, um, let's, let, the easiest way to explain that is let's just say a, a bone. Let's say that you broke your bone, 
you know, or something, broken arm, um, like doing like crazy black diamond skiing like people do. Um, crazy people. I'm sorry, Robin's a black diamond skier. Um, so you broke your arm and um, it healed. You put a cast on it and it was fine and it healed and everything was fine. But what you didn't really know is it didn't heal perfectly or maybe the tendons around it or the cartilage around it didn't heal perfectly. It's, it healed, it's fine, it's working. You're not in pain, you're not really noticing it, but it's not perfect. So what will happen a lot of times with the X39 is that when it's already gone around and done a bunch of stuff and it has nothing else specific to do at that moment in time, then it will go back and start healing things that were considered healed, but that had not healed perfectly. And this a lot of times will bring about what is called that retracing. I had it in my wrist. I had a torn cartilage in my right wrist uh, many years ago and it healed. Um, but it, after wearing the X39 for a little while, I would get these very strange, um, like almost like pins and needles or, or, you know, little lightning strikes that would take place uh, in my wrist and in the cartilage of my wrist and sometimes would go, you know, flash up into my elbow for a minute and all of that. And that was just uh, simply retracing. It was going back in and changing the gene expression, changing the way that all of it was, was working together and working around it. The, um, Try not to be too critical of it when it's happening because it's not going to last for very long. And in the long run, it's doing you a lot of good. Um, I had something happen the other night and I have no idea what it was, but I, I just started laughing. I thought, okay, that's got to be an X39, something or other. So I was, I was laying there. I was actually laying down watching a movie. And all of a sudden from my ankle, from like my ankle bone, all the way up above my knee bone went on fire. Uh, in a straight line for about three seconds. It was like, it was like a lightning strike went from both of my ankles to like shot right up the side of both knees. And, it, and I was like, whoa. And just as I thought, whoa, to myself, um, it, it stopped. And I was like, okay, <laughs> what, what chemical reaction had to happen in my body just now for that to happen? But I have to feel that it's correcting something because it was definitely nerves because it was, it was hot. So, I, you know, the retracing might fix a nerve, it might fix cartilage, it might even fix a bone, it might fix your finger, Robin's finger corrected. Um, and, but it's, uh, it's, it's just part of the thing. But like I said, it doesn't last for very long and in the long run, it's very beneficial. Thank you so much. Yeah, I had it happen too in my upper arm. This sharp pain oh, happened. Right. And then, you know, and I just took the patch off. Like when you take something, you can't untake it. But you could take the patch off and leave it on as long as you possibly can. If it's too uncomfortable, take it off. And know that it could be hours, it could be days, it could be weeks. But there's repair happening, which is very exciting. We have a whole bunch more questions and comments here. So uh, let's try to get through it. You up for sticking around a little longer, Dr. Sure. Sean? Yeah. Okay, great. Okay, so I'm just going to go down the list here because we have um, uh, some, we do not mention any disease states. So um, we only talk symptoms, just so you know. Um, so I'm going to skip that one. Um, <laughs> And what patches do you recommend? This is from Renata. Uh, do you recommend for hormone imbalance? Well, the reason that I do the X39 calls because I recommend the X39 first and foremost for everything. Um, I think the X39 should be like water or food, you know, just something that you just do all the time in order to make things run, collect maintenance and run maintenance. Um, then, but the, the SP6 I know has some uh, um, hormone balancing protocols that they have. I popped one on somebody's ankle that uh, on, I believe it's spleen six if mem memory serves. Yeah. And, uh, and, you know, stopped a hot flash that she was having. Um, I also was just reading, uh, something uh, in the research. I go into the science all the time in LifeWave and read as much as I can of what's going on because David really is a, a research crazy person. And so there's always great new stuff back there. And I was reading about some of the hormone balancing stuff even related to the Nirvana uh, patch. You know, Nirvana technically is, uh, you know, more of like a mood or anxiety or something like that. But I, I was reading there's some very interesting implications of Nirvana for uh, aching type pain 
you know, like chronic type pain and for hormones as well. Yeah. So, yeah. But you, you always, my, my first answer to any question is always going to be the X39. Like I said, just think of it as water, food, X39, and, and a dog. There you go. And, and I'm glad you brought that up because we do recommend people use X39 for 60 to 90 days before including any of the other patches. Unless, of course, you've got some severe symptoms and we want to make sure you're comforted with the other patches. But it, like, like Dr. Shauna says, it lays a foundation to help everything else work better. Okay, let, we got to go quickly here because we got some more people. Have you heard how or if the patches can help an amputee? Um, I would definitely think that they can. I mean, for, for one thing, the, the extreme rapid healing that the GHK uh, CU copper peptide does for skin and for in, you know anything internal, the, you know, those stories that we hear of the, the incredibly rapid healings from any kind of surgical procedure or, or anything. I would also think that because of the nerve foundations of your sympathetic and parasympathetic nervous system that it would help with the phantom uh, pain that a lot of times is associated with an amputee. Um, just because it'll start, it'll correct those, start to correct those nerve endings. Yeah. But yeah, it, it, I, I would think that it would have quite a bit of implication for that. Um, it, and then also too, I think that the, um, the energy enhancers might have some too, just to help correct whenever you have to uh, sever a nerve ending, whether it's an injury or, you know, something or a surgery or anything like that, the energy enhancers are helpful too, to get the flow happening again and to get the nerve endings moving the way that they should. Beautiful, beautiful. And many times if an amputee has a prosthetic device, there's, you know, rubbing and irritation that can happen. So the patches can be really helpful for that also. So it wasn't a real specific question. Um, Angel Cowgirl has um, a, a wonderful testimonial. Let's, let's hear from you and have you share it, okay? Because it's so fun to hear your voice. So I'm going to allow you to talk, Angel Cowgirl. <laughs> you should be hello, available. Hello. Hi. Can you hear me? Yes, we Hi. can. Hi. Hi there. Well, hello, everybody. I'm so thankful that you called on me. <laughs> well, we're glad to Thank have you, you. my dear. Yes, I would love to share actually a couple of different testimonies because people often ask me, can you do this with your animals? And so besides BJ, who on his third day of the X39, for his knee primarily, well, that was one thing that we wanted to target because he had been told that he either needed a knee replacement very quickly, or he would be looking into stem cell injections. And they are not covered by insurance in general, mostly across the U.S. at least. And so he was facing uh, anywhere between 1000 and 12000 per quarter uh, with no guarantee, they said. So he started to just kind of put it out to the universe, so seriously, and in popped an email from Gregory. And it was really out of the blue and Robin. And he reached back and said, you know, can you tell me a little bit more about this? And the rest is history, very happy history, because on that third day, he woke up and he could not believe the pain was gone and it was in his knee for 32 years oh my. from a Marine Corps injury. I mean, just incredible result. And so what happened is he had been waking up from the pain even, like in the nighttime, throbbing pain in the knee. And so he mm -hmm. knew it was right at that point. And his doctors had taken uh, some x-rays this year and said, you're bone on bone, you have to do something about this or you can end up not being able to walk at all. And a lot of you know, we're huge into the dogs and the nature and being out on our bicycles and et cetera. So this was just not gonna happen to Forrest. We were gonna find a way. And so this happened. So besides that, uh, then I have a dog that was bitten by a rattlesnake in June and he struggled quite a lot with, it was just a baby rattler, a tiny little thing. And I uh, struggling very much with trying to get back on his feet again. Mm -hmm. And we stuck that X39 on his collar. And within this one to two day period, he had doubled his ability to walk and his stability came back. And he walks with us approximately an hour a day now. And I mean, he nearly died. So that tells you that it doesn't just incorporate into their physical agility and their stability, but it really goes deep into their energetic being as far as having that kind of energy level. Back Beautiful. Again. Thank you so much. That was Thank you. Stories. Yes. Love, love, love hearing that. 
Yeah, Holy animals God. are amazing. Well, they react because they don't have, a lot of times with a human being, you'll do something to them and they think, I feel better, but it can't be the patch because I've only had it on for two days, right? And they talk themselves out of it. Where, you, you know, it, it, I do that all the time with supplements even too. People say, well, it can't be that or it can't be, you know, it's not just that I changed my diet. It's not just the patch. It's, you know, because they have to overthink it. Animals are like, I don't feel good. You put the patch on, they go, oh, I feel better. Okay, let's go. You know, they don't care. They're not going to question it. They are not going to ask, you know, oh, it can't be that. So sometimes they're even a better indicator, as in the movie we, we saw, Horses Don't Lie, that LifeWay put out. You That's know, so fabulous. It is. Yes. We have stories for horses, dogs, cats, fish, guinea Turtle. pigs, turtles. I mean, it's amazing. Okay, we've got one more here from Tim. Can I use X39 for 12 hours and take it off for 12, then put the same patch on again? And then he also said, patch for thyroid issues. So let's handle the first one, 12 on, 12 off, can use it again. And then the second question is, uh, what patch for thyroid issues? Well, the recommended for the patch is to only use it once. You know, to use it for 12 hours, take it off for 12 hours, and then put another one on in those 12 hours. The, it's, it's, a lot, it's an activation. You got to think of it as a frequency that's going in. And the frequency will run out at some point, otherwise it wouldn't be strong enough to create the reaction that you want. So, you know, the, um, I've never stuck a device of some kind on it and measured it, but it's just, I'm not smart enough to create the patches and David is, so I'm gonna go with what David says. And what he says to do is to wear it for 12, take it off for 12 and, and then use another one. The reason you take it off for the 12 hours is to avoid attenuation. So what happens is it, as the frequency continues, it'll wear out and then when you, it, it won't reactivate. So it's very important that you take it, um, put it on and take it off like that. Um, in terms of for thyroid issues, again, you know, the best thing to work with any organ is going to be stem cells. And so I think that dealing with the X39 is going to be your best uh, bet. Um, I think that trying to do too many um, disease specific protocols with the patches is a mistake in a lot of ways because, um, you know, I get, um, you know, texts and emails and things from people all the time saying, well, I have this, what do you do? And that's, to me, that's still a too allopathic of a way to, of dealing with a, a, a dis-ease state for me. Um, you know, it's like, if you have a headache, you take a pill. If you have a headache and you come to me, then I want to figure out why you have your headache. And I'm going to want to dismantle, you know, what caused that headache and deconstruct that. And so I think, again, the best thing to do is wear the X39s for a minimum of about 90 days. Let your stem cells have a chance to get going, uh, create more of a stability and more of a foundation for your body. Uh, for them to work with and to work with your medical person to try and rebuild that. But like what I still am always thinking in terms of rebuilding. And so that's going to be the stem cells because the stem cells are the Lincoln logs. And if you want to rebuild an organ, that's going to be the way to go. I think that treating the symptom is probably not necessarily the way I would direct people. That's beautiful. Thank you so much for that. Well, we could go on and on and on. And um, I just want to read from Jay. He said that been using Nirvana on several of my veteran buddies with very good results, relieving anxiety. Yep, beautiful. It. Beautiful. So um, I want to thank everyone for joining us this evening. A special thank you to Dr. Shauna for sharing your great wisdom as always. Uh, and then uh, if you're new and someone invited you here, please get back to them and know that we have a customer program where you can pay retail or wholesale. And we actually, if you're the kind of person that likes to share, we need voices out there to share. And you're very well compensated for doing that if you want to do that. So um, the patches do come with a guarantee, unlike uh, stem cell injections. A lot of stem cell clinics are, uh, we're getting more and more attention because they complement an injection and they enhance the benefits when people are getting injections. They're just getting stem cells. The copper peptide does so much more. Mm -hmm. So please get back to the person who invited you. Thank you all for joining us this evening. Uh, very glad to be with you and we will complete 
our evening together. Thank you, everybody. All right. <laughs> Stop our recording. Bye-bye.